this cloud? What is it? I don't know. I'll tell you what. It's the... <laughs> Or warned us about. They're happening. And the worst part is there's nothing we can do about it. We had our chance, but we failed. Oh no! <laughs> oh, well, what was it that the pterosaur said would happen exactly, Rex? Your basic worst case scenario. She said once all the cosmos stones merged, then all time and space would be doomed. And from the looks of it, that dark pterosaur that the Cosmos Stones created is the harbinger of that doom. If only we could stop it. But how? Helga! Please take care of... Grandpa! Is he okay? You who? Wake up, Doctor! Say something! Oh no, I think this is serious. Ah, we never even told him how much he meant to us! <laughs> how much we idolized him! It's true! <laughs> well, it's never too late. Tell <laughs> 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 me you ever heard of a hanky! Doctor! Grandpa, Grandpa you're okay! okay. Huh? For a sec, you almost looked... You know, done for, finished. Of course, you always kind of look that way. I do not! I'm bright-eyed and bushy-browed! Beneath this gray beard are bright rosy cheeks besides! I'm not going anywhere until I fulfill my destiny and become the one, the only, Dinosaur King! Destiny? Wait a sec. Hey, let's get back to the part where you guys idolize me and stuff! Why? You're perfectly fine now. We miss you with all our hearts, but you can't do this. It wouldn't matter if you only had one Cosmo Stone to trade. The risk is too great. Your father's right. All of destiny is counting on you, Max. All of destiny. That means everyone. From everywhere. Throughout all of time. And that includes you, Chomp. Huh? Hey, stop! Come on, Chomp! Cut it out, buddy! <laughs> I know. I feel them all with us, too. What is it, Max? What's Chomp saying? He's saying the same thing that my mom said. What? That all of destiny's in our hands, the entire universe, all of space and time and more. They're all counting on us, and in a way, they're here with us. After all, when those Cosmo Stones first crashed here, they nearly destroyed everything on Earth. But somehow, life found a way to keep going and led us to this moment now. I know you're all thinking it all seems hopeless, but things are always darkest right before the dawn. We have to keep fighting for our parents, for the pterosaur, for the past, present, and future, because if we don't, then there's nobody that will. But Max, what can we do? Yeah, we need a plan, and I, for one, don't have one. I do. The Dino Bracer? That's right, Rex. A while back, my bracer repelled the Black Cosmo Stone. Really? I wonder why. Well, my best guess is because of this. Of course, the stone plates! Zoe, didn't Seth say the plates carry a positive power? While the Cosmo Stones, on the other hand, carry with them a negative power. 
That could be the way to save the universe. Huh? Of course, since the Cosmos Stones have merged, they've created that powerful dark pterosaur. It's stronger than any one stone plate. Maybe, but not all of them. If all the Cosmos Stones have been combined, then I say we combine all the power of our stone plates. Am I a genius or what? A genuine genius and modest to boot. Ha ha ha! Great. So we combine the plates and dole out their power with our dino. Actually, Max, that won't work. What do you mean it won't work? Of course it's going to work. No, come on, think about it. If we're attacking the dark pterosaur with the stone plates from our bracers, our dinos won't be able to deliver the attack. Because our dinos can't wage attacks if the plates aren't there. Yeah, Rex is right. The plates need to be inside the bracers for a dino to attack. So, now what? Now we simply create a copy of the stone plates to put in the dino bracers. Say what? Yes, I have the data we would need all right here. Hmm, yeah, sure. Trust me, Max. I know I betrayed you all before, but what other options do you have? Now then, are you with me? There, how does that feel, Jonathan? Good! I feel like a new mandroid. All right, here are the copies of the stones. Great! Then let's go save the universe. Wait, first there is something you all must know. What is it, Seth? The copies of the plates we've created to allow your dinos to attack. They can't be used for anything else. In other words, once you summon out your dinos in attack mode, that's the way they'll stay. Uh, but that would mean... We'll never be able to play with them like there are pets again. They'll be big for good. In that case, let's play with them one last time. Oh. Here we go again. <laughs> Here I come, Ace. <laughs> Chomp. I'm gonna miss you so much, pal. I love you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Chomp. <laughs> oh, Chomp. I'll never forget you. I'll always remember all the good times that we had together, Ace. Best friends forever, Paris. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Put it in a card! Let's get this show on the road already! Give him a break, Grandpa! This is the last time they'll ever get to see their dinos like this! Ah, kids will be kids, I guess! It's not just them. The old lady said, too. Hey! I am not an old lady! But I am sentimental. Oh, how I'll miss you, my sweet little precious Terry! Oh, this is so hard, Spiny! I just never, ever want to let you go! No, let's not! I say we hold them like this for the rest of eternity! But I say no! Oh, great! Don't I have enough scars to remember you three little terrors by? Get off of me already! Off, off, off! The time has come. Let's go stop Spectre. Right. Well, Chomp, I guess this is really it. Goodbye, buddy. Ace. So long, Paris. Set the original plates together. Good to go. Let's do this. Hold on, everyone. Here we go. I'm bringing us within striking distance of the dark pterosaur. Okay, then let's get ready to strike, guys. Dino! Alpha 
though. All right, go for it! Uh-oh. What are you little tykes doing here? They always seem to find some way of showing up and being a pain. That's right, and if you thought that was painful, just wait! Now call all this off or you'll be sorry!